Funko collectors, this video is for you. Welcome back, this is Will with the Padawan Pops YouTube channel and today we are going to be breaking down all of these new Star Wars Funko Pops that have been released this week. Now I know it's not Christmas time, but it feels like it with all of these new releases. So I am wearing my Father Sithmas shirt today to be in the festive mood. And if I had to guess, you're probably pretty excited about these Ahsoka and Mandalorian Funko Pop releases too. So let's hop in and see what they look like. I am finding all of this information on Diz Tracker's Instagram page. Diz Tracker's always has the newest Funko releases before Funko actually releases them. So definitely give them a look if you do not already follow. But we got so many cool releases this week. This batch came out a few days ago. It was earlier in the week, but we get a look at Grand Admiral Thrawn. We see Morgan Elsbeth. We see one of Thrawn's night troopers and then another night trooper with a different pose, different helmet, slightly different details in each one. You see the number is 685 and 686 here. Then we get Shin and Balin. Those are the two I think that jumped out the most to me. I don't know this for sure, but it would not show shock me if these two night troopers like if one ends up being an exclusive or something like that I don't know it just seems a little bit odd that they would do something that is so similar I don't know maybe not we get again Thrawn Morgan Balin Shin two night troopers very excited about these I'm probably gonna pick up every one of these let me know in the comments from this batch what you're looking to pick up Outside of these, though, we also got an announcement for some new Mandalorian Funko Pops. Now these, I mean, it's season three of The Mandalorian. It feels like that was an eternity ago, even though it was only like six months. But I feel like Funko is just a little bit behind on these. Just my opinion, though. But we have Mando with a dark saber, and he's got a blaster, so that one looks pretty cool. We have Grogu in his little Beskar, for lack of better terms, baby carrier that he floats around in. We have Peli with Grogu. I think everyone has been excited for a Peli pop. I'm not sure if I'm going to get it or not. Maybe if it hits clearance. We have Paz Vizsla. I think everyone really started liking Paz in Season 3 of Mando. We have a Mandalorian Judge. I think this is one of the Mando Pops that we see on that planet that they are kind of holed up in. We see the armor. That is my must buy from this release. Out of all these pops, I don't have an armor pop. So when I saw that one, I was super excited. We have Bo-Katan sitting on her throne. We have Mando and the N1 starship. And then a few little keychains. I don't I don't really buy the keychains. Let me know if you do in the comments. I'm interested to see if anyone actually buys these and likes these. So let me know if you do. But yeah, these were the Mando season three releases. I would say I may get the armor. Probably Mando since he has the dark saber, and then probably Grogu because if you look like behind my head here, I do have a big Grogu collection on the wall, so I will get it kind of just out of the fact that I collect those. But big ones here for me, the armor and Mando. We also have an Ahsoka release. This is going to be from Hot Topic. She's got a little bit different of a pose here. I don't, I don't know if I'll get it or not. If the price is right, I probably will, but I'm really looking more for an Ahsoka the white, but let me know what you think about this one as well. We have Enoch. This is a close-up. This will be an Entertainment Earth exclusive. Enoch's pretty cool. He is, he is rocking the grumpy cat face there, but I think Enoch is a very cool character. I will probably pick this one up. I think I'll probably pick up most of the Ahsoka Pops. Let's see. Now, this was one a lot of people were excited for as well. The 332nd Company Trooper that is Ahsoka's clones troop clone troopers. This books a million is actually, um, that has been announced for a while now, and people are actually getting those in the mail now that pre-ordered. But this Target exclusive was announced this week, and I'm not sure which one I like better. I, I mean, I don't have a books a million anywhere near me. It's, it's a little bit of a drive. Just by proximity, I'm probably more likely to grab the Target one, but I do think the books a million one looks a little bit cooler. So drop a comment. Let me know what you think about these two. Which one are you more likely to buy, or are you going to buy both. And here is the post that has 
all of them on here. So we see this phase one clone trooper, which was in that Ahsoka flashback. I think it was in episode five in the world between worlds with Anakin, Enoch, the 332nd company trooper, and then this Ahsoka Tano as well. So we looked at all those. They're just, they're killing it with all of these Ahsoka pops. Again, let me know what you thought about these. We have a lot of Ahsoka announcements. We have some Mandalorian announcements. So I'm interested to see what you are excited to buy. So drop that in the comment. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. I do post Star Wars content daily. So if you're interested in that, I would love to share it with you. You should probably watch one of these two videos next.